So Diana ends up meeting up with the coach child, baby. She ends up meeting with the coach of dads and um the dads and the divas are making honey. And baby. That was some interesting. The girl with the horse, her voice was kind of hoarse. She looked like she was not about to play with Diana ass. She looked like she she was about to, she looked like she was jack, okay? And they meet up. And she like, I ain't here for the bullshit. Like, I ain't here for that. And Diana came off standing off. She was just like, well, you, you seem very confident. You seem very confident, da, da, da. And I hope you're such and such. And she was just, Diana didn't like her cocking it. And what's so funny to me is that I don't think they look up it, look at it objectively. Like you all be come you all come across as cocky, all the type of stuff. And just like, you know, I just don't understand. Like when Tyrus was fucking with you and telling you all the type of stuff, you didn't take that. Like you, you took it as a joke and all that type of stuff, but he was fucking with you, say he's gonna kick your ass. But this woman, you know, you might not like her. So I think that's why you did too much like the team. You didn't want them to advance because you weren't feeling the coaches. But, you know, I don't know what happened for, you know, for her to feel some type of way. But that coach, one of, I don't know if she was assistant coach, that woman, baby, she like, she going to beat a bitch ass. I kid you not, honey. She look like, I tried. I ain't one of them other hoes. You ain't finna have me. Hi-ya! Hi-ya! Girl, I don't even want to talk about that shit because, honey, let me tell y'all something. I hate the way they be doing my sisters and brothers on TV sometimes. That's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm make. Make sure when you, if you queen it out for these folks, make sure you get in the goddamn coin instead of some goddamn followers on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter. Because, baby, these folks will use your ass up for they fucking shit and make money off your ass, showing your ass on fucking TV. And you won't get, you won't have shit to show for. I mean, I just, girl, I done seen it too many times, honey. Not me, not me girl. Because I'd be damn, honey. I ain't queen out for no damn body like that, honey. It's just, but you know, that might be how Miss Tyrus is. That's how Nene is, but. She, you know, sometimes it just come off as too much. It's just too much. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. So what else was going on? So the Elite Stars, um, they came out, you know, for the for the solo. Um, and they, you know, and, you know, it was cute. It, it, it was in, in, interesting. The Elite Stars, it was interesting. The girl did her little thing. She did her little dip flip or whatever the fuck it was, and her legs were fucked up. The outfits were cute. Um, the dancing was cute, da 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 The Dads and Divas came out with the solo, and they had the mime stuff, and the solo was not necessarily a solo. Um, it just, I don't know. It just didn't look like a, it didn't look like a solo or something, because they were separate, like Diana said. It was just like one person over here, but that boy did buck down. He did, so that was cute. It's just, you know what? It's confused. They got creative dance. Solo, they got creative dance, duet, and what's and that shit's so confusing. It's so goddamn confusing. I don't even remember if that's what it was. Um, the Take Me to the King, that, uh, what's the name? They come out to do the Take Me to the King stuff. Um, Faith and Camera, and it was amazing. It was beautiful. I think everybody felt themselves because it was some gospel music, and they felt like passing ties and stuff, and everybody was in the spirit. And um, they had you know they had black Jesus on the cross, which I live for, and it was cute. Faith did that. Cameron did really really well, but Faith really showed her ass on this one. She really really did really really good. Like she just like slayed. She looked confident. She looked poised. It was just everything. Faith really really did that, and um, I wanted to take me to the King Music. I I, I wanted to I wanted y'all to buy the rights for Pilgrim Studios. Y'all gonna have to. Child, y'all had some whack ass, um, non denominational ass music, um, gospel music playing, and it was whack. It was whack, and it sounded bad. I thought I was at some tired ass gospel, um, guitar concert. Okay, country music. It, I hated it. And I felt like if we would have heard the music, we would have been a little bit more. So I'm gonna have to look around, see if I can see that, find the actual video too. I'm pretty sure somebody gonna email it to me. Um, Velocio Studio, stay in battle. They came out and they looked confused. I didn't see much, but I think they were, um, I think, the, I don't know who they went against. But they just didn't look like they were prepared. They just did not look like they were prepared. They didn't look like they were ready. I think they went against the Dams and Dolls. It was just like, you know, girl, they tried, they didn't conquer. So it was interesting. Um, the Dads and the Divas went against the Elite Stars. They, um, the Elite Stars get eliminated. The Dads and the Divas... Um, I think it was the dance and the divas, the way they dance, it was, it was some, it was just, it, it wasn't everything I needed. I felt like, I really do feel like Elite Stars should not have got eliminated. 
I really feel like, but I can't give that judgment 100% because y'all spend so much time Pilgrim Studios. Y'all spend so much goddamn time focusing on shit we don't give a damn about that we only see 20 seconds of the stand battle. That's what pisses me off. I don't give a fuck about um the, the damn DDPs in the damn dust-ass damn library room talking shit. I want to see the stand battle. That's what I watch. That's what I want to see. The intro is girls dancing. I don't want to see that tired-ass DDPs all the time. tired-ass. Maybe it's Maybelline-ass makeup. Girl. Oh, my God. Um, I don't know, honey. So... Oh, so these stars, they got sent home. Child, Miss Tyrus, baby, I'm going to tell you this. Your attitude, your, the dancing or whatever, your girls need to be on the, on your attitude level because you be getting all the camera time, but your girls don't get shit. Your girls don't get no damn camera time. You get camera time for you being you and your personality, but when it comes to your girls, they don't even never make it nowhere to even get look at a damn trophy. So, I don't know, you know, maybe it wasn't in the script this episode. <laughs> Shade. <laughs> maybe it wasn't in the script or whatever. But y'all didn't even advance. Like, but you, I just don't understand. Like, Tyrus, and I think you need to kind of figure out what you want to do. Do you want to get this thing or you want your girls to do it? Because you need to figure out what it is. Because you get more time than your girls on it. I'm, and I'm not featuring it. I'm just not featuring it. Like, so what's your purpose of doing this? Because every time I see, we seeing you, but your girls don't never make it. But you getting all the damn camera time. So do you want, you? So I think, I feel like you need to, some of these coaches need to figure out what, what the fuck they want. Do you want the damn camera time or you want your girls to do their shit and move and do what they got to do? Some of y'all get so blinded by these lights and these flash and camera. This shit ain't all that. I swear it ain't. Shit, that, that shit, that shit took Diana ass through there, honey. It, it took, that shit had her all types of shook. That, that, that famous shit, baby, you think you want that shit? That sh you got to be prepared for it. And everybody ain't prepared and groomed for it. Get to that in a minute. Um, So the Dancing Divas, you know, went against the Dancing Dolls. And, baby, the Dancing Divas, y'all have had stunts for days, baby. Y'all flipping it, flipping it, flipping it, flipping it here. But, baby, y'all could have been put, y'all could have been pulled over by police and busted for drug possession. Because, baby, them stunts were all over the place and they were not the best. Y'all need to perfect them. Y'all need to perfect them. Y'all, the girl was stepping on them and she, like, she had stepped on some damn glass walking on that girl back. That shit was a hot ass mess. <laughs> girl, that shit was so terrible. Trash. I hated it. Um, I didn't see too much of it, but it was just all over the place. Y'all went against the dancing dolls um, and y'all lost. Y'all got your ass. You know, they handled y'all ass. You know, it just it is what it is. And, you know, y'all had a lot of energy. Y'all had the energy. Y'all had the buck. And y'all got the hip-hop. But as far as, like, y'all need to perfect it. And I don't know what the hell y'all doing in practice. Maybe y'all have too many girls, and that's what it is, and you can't do it. Like, a teacher can't be efficient with the classroom of 50 versus a classroom of, like, 20. She can have more and more one-on-one -on -one time. So stop trying to get so much money from these parents for this stuff. And focus on making your girls better. You have to start small. Perfect these girls and move on up swiftly and professionally. Because y'all have the energy. Y'all have it. But them, them, some of them stunts were just not all over. And I was just, I was ready for some good stunts. But y'all just wasn't. And he had a point that the dancing dogs, some of this stuff does be repetitive. But they doing it repetitive and it's good. So you need to figure out what y'all doing. Because that shit y'all doing, that girl, like she was stepping on some goddamn cockroaches and, and, and um, glass. I was not here for it. So we get to the war, honey. Dance them dolls win first place for stand battle. But baby, they got second place for creative dancing. Baby, they was pissed off about that shit. Baby. And Cameron looked and she kind of rolled her eyes and all that type of stuff. She was looking kind of crazy. And um, I don't know who got first place. I think the Dazzling Divas got first place with that. I think they got first place with creative. I think everybody thought that it was a given because of the take me to the king and the gospel and the Jesus and stuff. You can't beat that. You can't beat that. But they didn't give it to the dancing dolls. They did not. They did not give it to the dancing dolls. The judges might didn't like it. And baby, Diana was pressed. She was pissed off and she said they were raw and all that type of shit. And this would be getting me. Like, and it was so funny. She had said a couple minutes ago, 
I, 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 when we, you know, we look, we lose. I just take it in stride. Da, da, da. But Diana, you were mad. You were throwing shit. You were pissed off and all that type of shit. And it just made you like a sore loser. It made you look very, very pathetic as far as your attitude and the way you were acting. It just was too much. And you were going off and cursing around your girls and stuff. Like the lack of professionalism that y'all have. I guess the fact that y'all don't have any is why y'all have the show. Um, because we like to see ratchet ass shit like that, unfortunately. But um, it was just it was just too much. Y'all lost. I mean, girl, you're not gonna win every one of them. You know, sometimes they put in, you know, sometimes they throw a monkey wrench in the script. Sometimes, so you know, they they lost, and Diane was very very pissed off about. It. She was just like they they robbed us and all that type of shit. It's just like, girl, it's just like, I, I don't be knowing what to tell y'all ass, honey. I just, I don't. And, and I don't know. And just, y'all be getting on folks when they be acting like they supposed to win. Like, it's just, y'all don't be looking at it objectively. Y'all don't. Because when y'all win and shit, y'all, and anybody else get mad, it's like, well, they didn't do that good job. But then when somebody, another team win, y'all act complete assholes like y'all don't. And you know what? There is no team I have seen this season so far that has not handled y'all ass like YCDT. Okay? There's not one team except who was there. Who was the um, Divas of Dance who ate y'all ass alive? Um, but it's not been one team that has handed it to y'all. That's why I miss YCDT so much. Because, baby, looking at them and watching them performance and seeing how they are, I promise you, if you have a chance, you need to look up some of their videos. Superstar. Some of their, like, when they go to these major red companies, well, not be, when they go to these football games and stuff, the girls be on point. Everybody is in sync. Everybody everybody and that's what makes it me makes it so good so when i see all of that and i see i catch mistakes that's why it's good for your girls to all have the same uniform on so you can be able to you know see what's not right so you know it was interesting honey um this episode was cute y'all tell me what y'all think um make sure you check out my website justinj1232 and i'll talk y'all later deuces bye